How's it going, everybody? It's Hecklejack playing Naruto to Boruto Shinobi Striker. Uh, I watched this cutscene already. <laughs> now, why am I playing this game in particular? Well, the answer to that is I get to create a character. And I love doing that in video games, and <laughs> I get to create a ninja in the Naruto universe. Heck yeah, I'm down. Also, uh, I kind of got this game for free thanks to having PlayStation Plus. But I know it has in game purchases. But I want to play the game first. Let's see. See what it's got to offer and what I can do. Each roll type has its own attack power, maximum health, and a jutsu repertoire. Hmm. Tuning exams from Naruto Part One. I'm gonna win this thing. What? I erase all who oppose me. Hmm. Well. Let's get rolling. Heading out. Just don't hold me back. I was notified early on that this was a different story. Welcome to the virtual Chunin Exam Finals Arena, brought to you by the VR Ninjutsu Arena. Here you'll be tested in a mock team battle to see if you're ready to join the Ninja World League. How you fight is up to you, as long as you show you're good enough. Alright then. Access to jump. <laughs> Man, could have returned the battle without tutorial. I mean, I'm not a big fan of this. <laughs> Past. Congratulations, you're good on your work, and I can now join the Ninja World League. Turn with your friends and aim to be the ultimate Shinobi Striker. First things first, though, we need to register your info. Hmm. Although that was not what I was expecting. I was expecting a one-on-one -on -one fighting game, like. Ultimate Ninja Storm. <laughs> you can change your avatar settings except Home Village. Anytime at the Wii Village Inn. Alright. Select Home Village. In Sand. Hidden Mist. Hidden Stone. And Hidden Cloud. Hmm. Eh, I'll go with the classic. Body type. Type 1. Hmm, this one's kid size. I 
Uh, look, I'm gonna go with type two. Now, what hair do we have? Hmm, that's Sasuke's hair. <laughs> Shikamaru's. Lee. Choji. I guess I'll go with default. That's Gara's eyes. Um, I used to watch all of Naruto back when I was a kid. So, well, I still have great love for the Naruto franchise. I still remember all the characters. <laughs> the main ones, anyway. Hmm. That is Lee's eyes, straight up. Okay. What about these eyes? What type of pupils? Hmm. Can I zoom in? Uh, doesn't look like I can. I can hardly see the difference in the eyes, aside from the size anyway. Hmm, I like these. I think this hair will be fine. Color? Ah, changes color of the headband. Let's see. Go with that. Uh, let's change the pupils again. Ah. That's much better, I can see the detail now. It's because it was dark that I couldn't. Pupils 12, 
13 and 9 kind of look like, well, 8, I mean, kind of look like uh, the, the Hyuga clan. I do kind of like this one, though. I like nose five. Yeah, let's go with that. A beard. That's awesome. Uh. <laughs> Let's go with default. Now face paint. Hmm. Not sure whose face paint this one is. Um, I think I'm gonna go with none. Yeah. Oh, now for a voice. <laughs> awesome. I was hoping they had voices. Okay, okay. Let's see what they got. Come here. Wow. Leave this to me. Do your best. Go! Come here. Back up, please. Come here. Okay to go. Back me up! You can do it! Thank you. Ah, this one. I'm looking for a calm voice. Voice 8. Got it. Okay, okay. Think of a name, think of a name. Trying to make my LC here, I'm thinking of a name. Hmm. Yeah, let's go with that. His name shall be Moon. Fail to retrieve server data. Accessing server. Secret technique gauge charge faster? Hmm. <laughs> what an entrance. teaching you the ropes. The name's Konohamaru Sarutobi. Let me know if there's anything you need, okay? Uh, uh, oh, it's, sorry. I guess I should speak more formally. Just ignore it if I slip up every now and then, okay? Uh, 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 <coughs> sorry to uh, cut to the 
chase, but uh, I'd like to guide you around the village. First, we have the VR Ninjutsu Arena. If you want to participate in the tournament, you'll probably come here a lot. Go ahead and visit the VR Ninjutsu Arena. I'll explain everything once we get there. Hmm. Exploring Hidden Leaf Village. The arrow on the screen indicates where you should head next. Follow the arrow and talk to the ninja it leads you to. Please go to the Hokage's estate if you wish to join the battle. You may also join events after completing Konohamaru's tutorial. Got it. Login bonus, Wayne Scroll. Thank you for your continuous support of Shinobi Striker. Update the item lineups. Custom Ninja Outfit Type 1. Hmm. Four boost events will be held simultaneously during the campaign period. Training point boost. Ooh, I love those in the video game. And EXP boost. Maintenance notification. Scheduled for... Uh, the next two days. Three days? Two days. Yeah. Confirm. You've accessed the online lobby during the maintenance period. We apologize for any inconvenience caused. Thank you for playing Naruto to Baruto Shinobi Striker. The Sage Jutsu training campaign will start after maintenance on June 30th, 2022, Thursday. Please note that campaigns start at varying times. See individual details for more information. Enjoy. Gosh, there's so much. But I expected it. Sage Jutsu Training Cafe version, which features costumes and accessories. Be sure to try it out. Mission play quick match with attack type and win three times or for when maintenance finishes on June 30, 2022 20, to July 7. Mission play quick match with defense type. Range type. Naruto outfit. Sage mode. Hmm. Madara Chia six pass. We have the Ninjutsu library. To receive Ninjutsu announcement, then purchase Special Master Ninjutsu training from PlayStation Store. Yeah, I saw that. Clash is to the three Shinobi Strikers who achieved outstanding results in Ninja World League. Number 68. You dope sense. Yeah, dope sensei. <laughs> what a name. Uh, the red and white battle is underway. Event period. Hmm. The ultimate event is underway that splits the Ninja World in two. The red and white battle. All entrances are invited to two opposing teams. One with the highest number of total points is declared victorious. As well as prizes for victors, points are up for grabs, which you can use to buy various rewards. Join red and white battle and fight with your comrades to be the best. Your team for the red and white battle is Team Slug. At the Hokage's chamber to enter the fray. This week's special mission. Participate in red and white battles. Yeah. Reminds me of the Naruto missions I would do on Facebook on that one Naruto game. I forget its name. Hmm. And I'm online. All oh, right, follow the arrow. Now, oh, sec, can I pause this? Well, yeah, I can, sort of. When you're online, the game will keep playing, even when you pause. Okay. 
Just a sec. Okay, sorry, had to take a little detour. All right. Hey, Kakashi. Oh, there you are. This is Lord Kakashi Hatake, the sixth Hokage and the teacher of our current Hokage. He'll be the one in charge of the VR Ninjutsu Arena during the tournament period. I'm just helping out a bit, really. The VR Ninjutsu Arena. So, is this the new tournament participant that I read about in the report? Yep, sure is. I've been put in charge of the guide duties. I see. Well, let me quickly explain how the arena works, then. It's pretty simple, really. You see, our village has developed a VR device. It lets you train anywhere that you want. It's simple, right? Yeah. Every time I hear VR, I think of VR chat. Booster Ninja. One of the coolest things about this device is that it also lets you fight with ninja from the past. Not the real people, of course. They're just data. But it's still real enough to let you experience how strong they truly were. Oh, by the way, the Ninja World League Arena is based on some stages from the past. They're from the times where the 6th and 7th were still active in the field, and were built to meet the requests of ninja who are serious about competing. Here, young ninja can fight serious one-on-one -on -one battles on stages based on famous history. <laughs> Does that just get your blood pumping? Well, whether it's pumping or not, you should just give it a try. We are missions. We can some our co-op missions that that you cover our players on. And ours are team missions that require an entire team. Let's try out the solo missions to have basic training so you can brush up on the basics of fighting. Congress, they forget the basics. different things in Henley Forest. First try to make your way to Kakashi's and basic movements. Next is wall running. Try running up that cliff. If you run straight toward it, you'll be able to run up the side of it. That's Looks cool. like you know how to control your chakra properly. Now I'll tell you about chakra jumps. You can use those to jump even farther distances. I kinda just did that. Come on! Chakra jump. to the charge chakra. Nice. When you want to cross a wide valley, just use a wire kunai. 
You can throw a wire kunai mid jump. Fix into a wall, you'll have to slide over there quickly. You could also use this as a recovery when falling. You can use a recovery if it seems like you're gonna fall off the cliff. So don't forget. Oh boy, here we go. One for trial and error. Nice. Alright. Next, I'm going to teach you how to attack. your opponent now. Normal attack. Those framed attacks are quick and connect easily. Long attacks are fire a bit fine, but they do a lot of damage. Each rose attacks have their own special effects, so it's important to study up on how to best use them. The key to attacking is to always keep an eye on your opponent. Yeah. Lock on. Yes, on thank you. Field, losing sight of your opponent is akin to suicide. Always keep this in mind. Thank you. Throwing kunai is a good way to hit far away enemies. Ninja tools allow you to attack enemies from far away. Some ninja tools deal damage. Bars activate special effects. Got it. Yeah. Protect your body when your enemy attacks. Do this by guarding. I'm assuming that's L2. Yep. Guard in order to withstand your opponent's attacks Whoops. and create openings. Now, you should know that you also have the ability to deflect enemy attacks while guarding. Don't forget Whoops. to predict your opponent's moves and dodge when you can. Huh. Whoops. There we go. Whoa. Is there a block meter? I noticed my block it broke. Whoops. Okay, hang on, lock. There we go. All right, lock. Ooh. If there's not enough time to guard or dodge, remember that you can always just use a substitution jutsu. Substitution. When you get attacked, perform a substitution to greatly reduce damage. Once you use it, you'll have to cool down before you can use it again, so be careful. After using the jutsu, you can take a moment to think and plan your counterattack. Hmm. R2. Okay. When flinching. Okay, got it. Ninjutsu. Here we go. Now this is the fun part. Are more powerful than normal attacks. There are a ton of different jutsu out there. 
Some can buff allies and others can summon creatures. Once you use specific and juice, you won't be able to use it again for a while. But if you hold that and juice button down, you'll be able to shorten the cooldown time. Interesting. Ninjutsu can be activated by channeling chakra. The effects of each jutsu widely vary. Some jutsu are made for dealing damage, while others can be used to impair opponent's abilities or to freeze them in place. Finding the ninjutsu that best fits your own fighting style is the key to attaining victory. Aside from basic ninjutsu, we also have secret techniques. Charge up your secret technique gauge in order to activate your secret technique, Jutsu. It's far more powerful than normal ninjutsu. It will fill up over time, but you can make it feel faster by attacking and recovering. In order to activate a secret technique, Whoa. one needs a large amount of chakra. But be aware that these techniques are much stronger than normal ninjutsu. Use your chakra, wait for the right time, then aim and fire. Well. That's it for basic training. Now, just don't forget to practice. Good work, and keep on doing your best. Nice. Okay, I'm definitely gonna practice more. This looks like so much fun. Level increased. special training. Okay, I just added a mission to the arena for you. We'll task you with different Briarch in order to assist you in your training. If you find a ninja with a mission mark over their head, try talking to them. In the arena training, we'll unlock more VR arena missions. Hmm, I know. How about this? Why don't you take on Kakashi's mission in order to review everything you've learned? Good idea. This way, you'll be able to review everything from taking a mission right down to clearing one. You can start the mission whenever you want. Once you're ready, speak to the sixth. Kashi special training. But it is a very dangerous. I get it the perfect job for a new. For some reason, Kakashi is acting strange. Ask him for details and complete the mission. Is that an emote? <laughs> There's emotes in this game. Lovely. Oh, you want to enter the VR ninjutsu arena? Well, make sure you're relaxed and ready to give it your all. Kakashi's training. Kakashi has set your craft. He's trying this. Wait, what? Did I go back? Oh, it's matchmaking. Wait. Is this, shouldn't there be a loading screen or something? Well, 
see if someone made Kakashi straight up. <laughs> Another one. Hey Kakashi, what are your clothes over here? <laughs> anyway. Uh, hmm. Uh, let me try talking to him again. Uh... Hmm, something should be happening, right? Oh! I just saw a start mission. Okay. She's also helping. Alright, this is some platforming segments. I love it. Uh, hmm. Hurry to Kakashi. It's big out. <laughs> Paradise. Just stop Kakashi and get the reward. <laughs> Level up. A 
Takashi scroll. Good work. Hmm, impressive. It looks like you've really gotten the hang of using the VR ninjutsu arena. The reward you earned is yours to use as you see fit, but it is possible that some of them need to be appraised. You can do that at the place I'm going to guide you to next, the Ninja Tools Shop. Come on! We'll head over there next and I'll show you the ropes. Follow me! Ninja Tools Shop. By various arms, weapons, costumes, accessories, you can also appraise scrolls you can earn for free. Head to a ninja tool shop and try appraising the scroll you just earned. Now see that's where Tintin is. Light version launch celebration here. Alright to launch celebrate the launch of the light version of the free Aceratic Scroll. <coughs> Luck is on your side, it'll be a rare one. Ninjutsu manuals. Now on sale. You can acquire new ninjutsu by buying manual for it. Acquired ninjutsu can be equipped at the end. Just select the ninjutsu mask from the purchase menu in the ninja tools shop. Moonlight scroll. Heh! <laughs> for the odds. That's that's my name. Aside from light, those are powerful scrolls used to summon special items. They might even yield items of S rank or higher. That quality scrolls can't summon. For appearance, rates, see the reward list. Change costumes or accessory skill. I have no shinobi boost seals. Okay. One plane scroll, one quality scroll. Ten. It's a rhetoric scroll. However you pronounce that. Huh. Light medicine. Scientific ninja tool. Swirling storm. Ah, so I have a chance of getting new accessories, huh? Cool. You know, outfit. Dinky outfit. Getting version. Top for men. Kakashi scroll. Let's see what this gives. Young leaf iron knuckles. Okay, let's open all ten of these. Uh, see? Wow. Yep. Seems I got some legendaries. D two double S's. That's a thing in this game? Oh boy. Okay then. So I can buy scrolls, right? 
Oh, go to a PlayStation store for that. Got it, got it. What can I purchase? Costumes, avatar parts. Ah. Ninjutsu manuals. Cool, cool. So I'll definitely consider this later. Okay, all done. If you find anything else you want me to appraise, just bring it by and I'll take a look at it. Oh, it looks like the appraisal went quite well. That's great. Now, next, you should try and equip what you earned. You can equip things over at the inn. The inn is right next to this place, so I'm sure you'll spot it immediately. Let's head there now. I know that's how I was hearing cats. <laughs> hmm? I haven't seen you before. This is one of the new tournament participants, Sakura. I've been guiding them around town, explaining things to them. Oh, okay. So you're planning to be in the tournament too, is that right? I'm Sakura Uchiha. The tournament staff needed more people, so I decided to help out. Nice to meet you. So, I'm guessing that since you're here, you want to change up some of your equipment, right? Yes. Okay, it's not that hard, so let's get it over with. Here's how you change I can your imagine. equipment. Now, make sure you listen carefully. There's are four different battle equipment loadouts, which can freely be switched whenever you respawn during battle. I guess I could go with that. Uh, change battle equipment. Slot one, attack. Weapon, hand hand combat. A handkerchief. One tail white guard. <laughs> I do not like this outfit, honestly, but I gotta do it for the completion. Uh, wait. Uh, this is kind of awkward, but it seems my timer is almost up. So that about wraps this video up, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. I'm still going to play more of this.